Hello, it's Mercy here from Gems of War. This is the weekly summary for the 26th of October 2020. And I have here with me Sparkstar. Hello. Uh, Sparkstar is an old guild member who left to start up Guild Member Academy. Uh, and he has come back with us. If you look at the roster, he's joined right down the bottom. In fact, he is the lowest level member of the guild at the moment. I used so, to be really high. I know, and you're going to promise to play lots, aren't you? Oh, um, okay. The reason why he's joined us is because the academy isn't going so well, particularly because Hoax joined us this week. So welcome back, Hoax. Hoax is from Australia, and he is one of the origin original members uh, of Dalriata way, way back uh, a year and a half ago. Um, and he ran our Discord channel for a long time. So welcome back, Hoax. Now, today, I am going to run through the events of the week, uh, how we've done um, talk about a bit of strategy again, and then probably do some promotions and demotions looking at the roster and discuss what's going to happen next week. If we have time at the end of the video, then Sparkstar and I may, may do a arena run, because next week there are two arena events, which is really horrible actually, because arena's not that great. Um, but uh, it might help, uh, the rewards are not that good, so um, it might help if we talk through arena it might help some people or it might um motivate some people to get onto chat and tell me how i made some really bad decisions in my arena teams so we'll do that at the end of the video so starting off let's go and look at the events so the events of the week were actually i'll do it this way the events of the week were guild wars of course so let's go have a look at the guild wars once again we did brilliantly five wins if we look at the results uh, El Diablo uh, Paragon, he got 57,737. Let's do anybody what? beat him. Yeah, I know, he's good, isn't he? Um, but look, look, Lyric, Lyric's close. Your Virtuoso's pretty close. Speaker Town's pretty close. <laughs> Gunter's pretty close. I'm probably not even there. No, you won't be. Um, who else have we got? I Saint Libra's <laughs> really close. Crazy Gamer didn't play. That's a bit of a problem. We'll Edward. talk about that later. Edward. Saying, blah, blah, blah. Uh, where am I? <laughs> I'm afraid to find myself. Uh, Zuaizu didn't play, but that's okay because Zuaizu's not been well this week and let us know on Discord, so that's fine. Valkyra didn't play, so that's a bit of a problem. Surely missed the last couple. Where am I? Oh, there I am. 55,000. I had a bit of a nightmare actually. I'll show you why. Um, look at my defense. So when I set up my defense, uh, well, I didn't set up my defense. That was the problem. So the computer did it for me. Oh. And I've got, yeah, random teams. So there's my Guild War Defense Yellow, which is correct. That should be on Yellow Day, which is correct. There's my Red Day, but it's on Brown. I've, for some reason, the Skeleton T team's on my Blue Day. My Purple team's on Purple, so that's all right. My Brown's on Green. So it's all stuffed up. Uh, okay. Um, and if you look down the bottom, I only had 21 different troops. Because look, Mountain Crusher, Mountain Crusher. And see, there's another Mountain Crusher. So the Mountain Crusher, which is completely crazy. That's just not... And Taipans appears twice. So these aren't my teams. Well, they are my teams. They're on my roster, but they've kind of randomly been put in. Um, mm -hmm. So I that was... I kind of stuffed up. So I didn't get the points for this thing down here, so that's why I was kind of a thousand down. Uh, so that's a, bit, that's a bit of rubbish. But anyway, we did really well in Guild Wars, so we've won yet again. Oops, let's just have a look once more at that because we'll have a look at the ranking so we got 1.2 million points the closest was 249,000 so you know that's probably not bad being having six times more than the um, the next one down so we'll go up into bracket 144 we'll get some ori cards and some gems and stuff so that's great so well done well done everybody that's brilliant i love guild wars and i love uh, i know people find it stressful but it's uh I love it and I love mm -hmm. winning by that much. So well done. Now Darkness My Old Friend was the let's go, let's do the good news first, shall we? Um, uh, so there were two. There was a world event Darkness My Old Friend and there was the Raid Boss event this weekend. That was a three day one. Uh, which Sparkstar is sitting here playing on the right pad, just trying to catch up. Um, so Darkness My Old Friend, let's go have a look at that one. Now we let's have a look at the reward because we didn't make stage twelve. And I Ooh. predicted this uh, when I did my last weekly summary, I said we seem to alternate in the world event. We do, we get it one week and then we don't get it the next week, get it one week, don't get it the next week. We didn't get it this week. And here is the problem. It's not Edward. 
He's not the problem. It's not Ganter. It's not you, Virtuoso. It's not Ebev. It's not me. It's not Holy Triceratops. Hey, look, Valkyria did this really well on this, but not in the Guild Wars. That's really weird. Um, Valkyria, do your Guild Wars. Um, Joe Cover did really well again. Lyric did really well. And then if you notice, all these guys, are, most of these guys are the Sentinels. Speaker Town, again, really well. Shadow, really well. Oxus, Oxus only joined the Guild a wee while ago, but always does really well. None of these guys did really... These guys did all really well, right down to here, the thousand minimum. Dennis, well done, because you got that yesterday. You were on zero, I think, up until yesterday. Uh, but here's the problem. Cool Klaus, tra crazy gamer, Sparks. That's <laughs> you, clearly. Um, Lex Tull, MT, Pilsink, all got zero. Now I we didn't have. Join the guild like three seconds yeah, ago, I know, though. Yeah, I know. Oh, yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> and, um, but you need to play the events it's mandatory it's been mandatory a month now and it is a I'm demotion running. the world event not playing in the world event is a demotion offense uh without exception because this is really important and it's really important because of this thing here the major orb of chaos and the reason why it's important is because all these guys up here are now like at a level a thousand two hundred plus and the only thing they've got left in the world to do is uh where is it they want this thing here they want they want they want they're all saving up for this guy this guy here Zulgoth um, ba -dum, ba -dum, kills an enemy what? and we know Zulgoth because we fight him in the raid boss event and you what you need to get Zulgoth is you need eight power orbs I have one <laughs> <laughs> I have absolutely none. no I know and I want Zulgoth so I need eight I need seven more power orbs orbs and how do you get them you get them down here you get them by you get them by where is it um there you get them by combining combining three orbs of ascension uh, three orbs of wisdom and three orbs of growth but, uh, not only that aren't they major orbs yeah they're major yes the major orbs major orbs. so uh, you need the major orbs so Oof. you need to get to we need to get to stage 12 don't we i have like eight major orbs of um Growth. Yeah, well, you need, well, you need, well, I need seven times nine. What's seven times nine? Seven, um, Six, 63. 63. <laughs> so I need 63 orbs, and these ones are the Ooh. orbs of ascension are much harder to get. So, um, it's, it's, it's a lot of finishing events. Mm. Anyway, so demotions for all those who didn't do that event. <laughs> That's not okay. Uh, so that will happen after this, and I can't get demoted. we have another event this week. So we had the three. Yeah, you can't, can't yet. Um, <laughs> Not yet. You had the, we had the third. The third event this week was the raid boss, and the raid boss we did get to the end. So we did get on my major orb of chaos, and really luckily, just you know, I've got the luck of hoax. Um, I got a major orb of plans, which of course doesn't turn into an orb of power. So that was a bit rubbish. But anyway, Very lucky. Uh, you get a whole bunch of orbs and a whole bunch of cool things, and we got that all. And then, and if you look at it, I of course am completely awesome because I got twenty four thousand. Uh, Shadow was amazing. He held the lead pretty much all week. El Diablo, no surprise up there in the top three. And then you have all these same guys again, uh, all the Sentinels, uh, and then all the guys. Oh, Valkyrie, you did really well on this one too. Hmm, why didn't you do Guild Wars? Anyway. Not a not a not a demotion offence, so you're, you're okay. Um, oh, Hoax did all right, even though he only joined a few days ago. And we have uh, again, we have this tail, and we have a bigger tail on this one. So look, under a thousand, under a thousand, under a thousand. Well, Dark Side doesn't count. Under a thousand, under a thousand, under a thousand, and it's all the same guys again. So goodness me, play your events. That's what it's about being in a guild, because the important thing about it is you get all the rewards that all these other guys earn so all these other guys all these guys are earning these rewards and you're just cashing in on them and they're not playing and that's not part of a guild that's not okay so that to me that is it means you're not interested in being in the guild and if you are somebody who doesn't join in chat and share teams because we share teams in our chat all the time and it's really handy um then you, you're just you're just going to be demoted and kicked out so if you want to play in this guild play events there we go there's my big yarn okay what is happening um so we did actually we did really well overall smashed guild wars smashed 
um, Raid Boss got pretty close, so he actually did really well. This was a this was a good week. Um, what else has been going on this week? We had campaign. Campaign is doing really well at the moment. Um, if you're not doing campaign, really get onto it. So I know a few people aren't because I know they're not playing on Mondays and Tuesdays, so they're probably not doing campaign. Tasks, uh, do your tasks. The artifact gives you these things, and these things remain during the campaign, and they remain for everything. So I have got all these bonuses uh, in all uh, events and everything for the next seven weeks so it's really really good and these in increase each week so on monday today a new campaign will come out i'll complete that and i'll get four more or two more things it'll probably be armor this time and it'll probably be plus four to armor or something or plus five to armor i don't know so that will be great it'll be good for my rowane team so play the um campaign get on discord uh, because i post all the clues and answers to the campaign and the campaign's really fun because you use teams you wouldn't normally use. So anyway, what we've got coming up, we have Monday, we have an arena event. So that's this this thing down here. Um, we have a world event, so another world event. And remember, it's absolutely compulsory. It may contain um, Centaurs, Mystics, and Divinion Field troops because Divinion Fields is the uh, kingdom for next week. Um, this is it here. The uh, Who is the... Who is the, who is the, um, who's the mystic? I think it's Worldbreaker or something like that. Worldbreaker, the Worldbreaker is the mystic. Um, is there another one? Not sure. I think it's just, I think it's just him. Uh, so it's actually quite a good mythic. So use your event keys to try and get him if you don't have him. Um, well, the Wendigo is quite good. He comes from the faction assault for this one. And there are another good few cards that are worth oh he's not mystic I, I, I need to upgrade him uh ragnar gord is really good he's a really good mana generator for this one so look to use him and not so many other brilliant ones herdmaster is another mana generator that's a really good mana generator so we'll be using these ones in fights this week uh we have tuesday we have primal rift is the um where is primal rift Primal Rift is the faction assault, so I might find it. I think I think Primal Rift is my worst one, so we will be heading into. Oh yep, I'm okay. We'll be heading into do Primal Rift, and I will be posting. I wonder if I've even got one to see a team. We'll be posting. Oh okay, I use a Shiba. I've been using a Shibani team. That's interesting. Um, I'll post the uh, pure team, which will use these guys. I think it's actually pretty much that team. I think. Um, I will post it anyway on chat so you get to use the pure team on Faction Assault Tuesday if you want. Uh, and actually I've got better purple teams than that. I've got much better purple teams than that. Um, I've got a I've got a crackerjack purple delve team, I think. That will do that will do brilliantly in there. I think it's my Silver Necropolis team. No, I can't show it to you. Um, anyway. I'll post some, or well, well, everybody will post, or well, most people will post some, some decent teams. Uh, and remember, that's the key to getting your gold contribution. So, you know, if you play the, if you play the um, faction assault up to level one fifty and do a couple of pure team runs, you pretty much get your five hundred thousand k for the week for gold contributions. So you can do that by Tuesday. The pet on Wednesday is Howler, which is a cosmetic Halloween pet. Um, I don't have it, so I'll be going for it, but. It's not doesn't give you anything. Um, what have we got? We've got Dominion Fields, so it must be Oracle, Cynical, or Centaurs, Oracle, Oracle class on Thursday, um, and the Oracle class is it's not too bad. I think we'll be using it a bit this week um, because it has Centaurs. So Centaurs get two life, gain one life, lots of life Centaurs, some magic. Um, so we'll be using that one, and I think, oops, I think it's, yeah, here we go, it creates uh, a nice yellow storm, so uh, creates a light storm. So um, 
get your oracle up on Thursday and then Friday we've got another arena event which is bizarre and it's a three day arena event so the rewards are going to be a bit different so I'm not sure how that's going to work and that is the end of the week um, should we go through promotions and demotions what do you reckon uh, should we do that quickly or do we just do that on chat let's just have a quick look so very very quick look um, I think everybody's hit targets this week except you since you only joined 15 minutes ago um, and probably host uh, let's just have a look so again sentinels smashing the world to pieces um, have you got anybody going up to sen so Joe uh, Lex Lex how did you get so much but didn't do the events that's interesting MT you didn't do the events either so you're gonna it's gonna be you guys are gonna be demoted despite giving lots of money it's kind of bizarre Valkyra you did great in the events you gave lots um, but you're already a commander you guys need to talk more and share more on chat you need to share your teams even if you don't talk just share your teams and you'll get up to be sentinels if you share your teams sharing your teams is awesome because actually for an example I got really stuck on raid boss at about 16,000 and I called out on chat to get a new team and I think it was holy triceratops might have been lyric uh, uh, might have been speaker town I'm not sure one of those guys posted their team and it was a team that Edward had been using the whole time and um, that just transformed it and I was able to sort of power on another 8,000 points so thank you very much you guys whichever one of you it was um, that's that's the that's the reason why you post on um, your teams in chat so if you want to be a sentinel get away from being a commander you need to post in chat and if you don't need to talk in chat if, if you're not comfortable just post your teams um, here we got everybody else is doing well doing well Nikki Dcat see look wonderful contributions thank you very much but you didn't play in the events uh, well actually well maybe you did one of them I have to go check I'll go back and check cool Klaus didn't hasn't reached it we'll be going down uh, and didn't do an event um, Oxus probably going up because um, did re has done really well in the events Crazy Gamer didn't do the events going down. Zwazu gave an excuse this week, but still managed to make the contribution, so that's nice. Uh, so some of these guys will be going down. But nobody will be booted, so there'll be no no kicking this week, which is great. Uh, happy with that. So that is the end of the weekly summary. Should we do should we do one arena fight? We got time to do one arena fight? Okay, sign off. Uh, sign off if you're going to um, because I don't think Sparkstar's ever done a arena yet, so we're gonna no. we're gonna we're gonna talk through it. Um, so sign off if you've seen the weekly event. Well done, thanks for making the game so awesome. Uh, let's keep it up. Let's now let's let's hit since there is only one real world event, a uh, run real event this week. Let's really smash it. So please, everybody, play it. Um, minimum minimum of one thousand five hundred points this week, and we will get there. So right, I'm now gonna do an arena. So sign off and stop the video unless you want to listen to us chatting about arena so here we go let's go oh i'm halfway i'm a bit over the way through an arena oh. let's just retire that one uh yes let's oops retire so now we are going to start start the arena oh. um here we go so this is what you do so you draft you draft your cards here, here look at this so you draft your cards we've got three choices uh, and the first the first pick they're all um, mono mana so none of these guys are actually very good I think so this guy oh, transforms in, he transforms into okay. a dragon he's okay um, that's quite good to transform into a dragon uh, but it can stuff up your mana so if he if he you choose him to be red and then choose your team with a red first one and then he turns into a dragon that's you know uh, brown and yellow then he can block your brown and yellows down here so that's a bit rubbish creates four blue goons frozen by enemies we don't want a generator yet not a rubbish generator like that what does he do steals 11 gold who cares that's quite a lot of damage though he does a lot of damage for eight mana should we have him as just a damage dude no. yeah let's recruit him let's recruit him for damage okay so we've got a need now we don't want to we, we can shift around the order of them 
but we really don't want to choose we want to choose as many different mana types as we can so monkey disciple or knight terror will probably be our first choice because i think he's quite good isn't he give all allies five life creates red and yellow gems that's quite good isn't it mm. um that means our next two drafts should be red and yellow yeah uh, I'm I'm favouring him because he also because he gives us life as well, which is quite handy. I'm favouring him because it's explode a gem, deal eight damage to the person, reduce all people gems, destroy gem person. Blah. Let's have a look at who's next. This guy does nine damage to the weakest enemy and steals one magic, so he gets stronger. So next time it'll be ten. He only gets to use him two or three times, so big deal. So I'm going to choose monkey disciple. Put him in there. So now we want what do we want? We want green and yellow, red and yellows, don't we? So we've got two yellows here, so Hind, what does Hind do? Deal 8 damage to an enemy, gain 2 mana back, turn 5 to 10, it's an extra turn for each entangled enemy. Does he entangle anybody? No. Lasher does lots of damage, but he's not the colours we want. 6 damage to 6 random enemies, which is awesome. That's really awesome. He can, actually, he can probably win by himself. He's brown. Uh, didn't we want red and yellow? We wanted red and yellow. Oh, red and yellow. Oh, that's so bad. Oh, red and yellow. I know, we made a bad mistake. Mm. Solari, let's have a look at Solari. Give all other manners quarter of their mana, deal eight damage to an enemy if they're undead person and mark them. So that's not bad. Eight damage to an enemy. What are we going to do? I reckon Lasher, if we put Lasher first, I reckon Lasher will just win the game. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, so... That's my advice from this video. Uh, that that would just seriously. You fire him once. Actually, I'm not going to do that. I'm not, I'm not even going to play our strategy. Um, red and yellow. So we can choose the yellow. What does he do? Ten damage to an enemy. Explode three red gems. That's really good. Yep. Oh, what are you doing? I'm doing the arena. Oh, okay. Um, wait till I'll help you after the video. So let's choose him. 10 damage when he frees, give three magic to all allies. That's really good too. So which one do you want? Do you want Bandit or Zack Kaboom Grizzle? Don't mind which one. Let's get Zack because he creates mana. Okay, so here we go. Here's our team. Um, we're going to put Lasher first. We're going to put Bandit. Doesn't really matter where. We're going to put Zack. Doesn't really matter where. Monkey Disciple second. So that's our team. Ready? Let's go. Ooh. Okay, so long as so long as Lasher doesn't get killed, we'll just do one fight. So long as Lasher doesn't get killed, he will win the game. So we just want to get Lasher going. So let's just get Lasher going. Come on, come on, browns, greens. Any can you see any browns and greens? Um nope. Rats. Okay, what do we want next? We probably want um no we don't care about him. We want him. So, do it, go to yellows? No, go to blues? Oh, what is it, blue? Come on, come on, go the greens. Ah, look at that, that's rubbish. Oh no, it doesn't, doesn't matter, it doesn't really matter. Uh, because, look at this. Oh, that's, that's, no, we can't even get that. Although that's giving it to him and he'll kill us, so let's just get rid of that. Now let's do it. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, it didn't kill anybody. It will though. <laughs> it will. Trust me, it will. Um, okay, who? What do we want to do? Oh, let's kill Johnny Fella. It's ten damage to an enemy. Explode three red gems. Let's get that guy because that guy's quite mean actually. So let's take that. Let's let's take out him. That's good. Um, he's almost up. Can we get him up completely? Greens. Yes, we can. Not gonna, not gonna make give him a match, is it? Six that'll kill him. We don't want to do that. So if I took that greedily, he would get the skulls and kill me. So I want to get rid of those skulls. Let's get them rid of them by this. Nice. Now we still need Lasher up. Um, can you see how to get Lasher up? Yeah, brilliant. Okay, this will finish the game. Oh, actually, hang on. Let's, we could do that, but let's just let's do this fun. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. 
Yeah. Okay, and that's how you play arena. So it's all about ah. it's all about it's all about choosing your cards really carefully. Okay, that will do for the week. Well done, everybody. Um, perhaps we'll do another arena video during the week because arena is a bit hit and miss. Uh, we can talk about rewards, but otherwise, well done. Nobody's been nobody's been kicked out. A few demotions, but really, again, the message for this week is focus on the events and share your teams on chat 